Hey everyone, so this is just going to be a quick update follow-up video on um, the Brooks Glycerin GTS 20s. I did an initial impressions video several months ago when I had just gotten them, um, had them for about a month, logged in about 50 miles. So this is going to just show uh, how they've held up over this uh, past several months and they have held up well. Uh, if you like this sort of video, um, I really appreciate the like and subscribe. I will put the link for my original initial impression video as well um, in the description. So not a whole lot to cover here. It's not super complicated. Uh, they have held up beautifully. Uh, like I said, I've probably run over the past 10 months or so, almost 10 months owning these, uh, a little over 400 miles on them, mostly on pavement. Uh, I'd say probably three quarters of that, give or take, was on pavement and then the rest probably on a treadmill. Uh, anyways, the uppers, beautiful, uh, water resistant, I mean not waterproof, but very water resistant, have run in rain in these things. My toes have not worn a hole in them, that's a good thing. Uh, there is a little bit of wear on the left shoe toe, but that's not because of me wearing it down, that's actually because of me tripping on a sidewalk on one of my runs and uh, almost wiping out. But it hasn't spread, it hasn't gotten worse, that hole hasn't gotten any bigger, so I'm happy about that. Um, when I initially reviewed these things, uh, I said I was really impressed with the cushioning, and the cushioning just seemed to get better. Cushioning is held up. Uh, it's still pretty much just as comfortable to run in them as it was for the first 50 miles, and I really, really like the cushioning on them. I still really like the big toe box. Very, very comfortable, and more so now probably because they have con the bends and everything that it's kind of conformed to my feet. I was a little bit concerned in my initial video about the outsole, the tread. Uh, I was comparing them to ASICs because in my original video I had talked about you know wearing ASICs pretty regularly for the past seven years or so, seven or eight years running, and you know the tread is held up well. I'll get a close up here. So, for the most part, the tread is still there. You know, I mean, it's you know, 400 miles in. I'll probably be getting another pair of running shoes here in the next couple months, but it's kind of smooth there on the, uh, towards the heel on the outer side. Pretty smooth, I should say, actually. Um, getting a little thin. So, but, you know, they... They've held up pretty much typically kind of like the A6 that I ran in have held up. So I'm very happy overall with how the tread has held up. Um, the actual shoe itself, the durability is good. My, our dog actually uh, got a hold of the heel a couple times when I was walking out the door uh, getting ready to run and she clamped down on the heel and, you know, little couple bite marks there, I guess, but nothing major. So overall, uh, excellent, excellent shoe, uh, GTS, uh, Glycerin GTS 20. Uh, I am holding out a little bit uh, before I get my next pair of shoes because I know the Asics Kayano 30 came out already, so I'm really itching to try those on. But I really want to compare them to the Glycerin GTS 21s, which are still not released. If you happen to know when the Glycerin GTS 21s are going to be released, I was hearing a rumor that, you know, later in August or later this month, um, but I haven't heard anything else. So if you know when the Glycerin uh, GTS 21s are going to be released, uh, drop a comment down there for sure. I want to um, definitely try those out and compare them to the Asics Kano 30s before I decide which is going to be my next running shoe. In the meantime, I'm just going to keep running these because they're still really, really darn comfortable and uh, I can still put probably several more miles on them, probably a couple more hundred miles before I finally um, replace them and they get relegated to just kind of everyday use after that. Uh, okay, so that's all I got. Hope you liked it, hope you liked the update, hope it was useful and I guess I'll see you guys next time.